Hello guys and in today's video I'm going to be making a mob race. However, this mob race will only be made using the tools from a marble kit. I cannot create any of them myself and I cannot use any of my components. I cannot choose the specific marble kit I'll use, I'll just use the first one that shows up in the alga box. So with all that said, let's get started. Alright, so this is the marble kit I'm going to be using. Fun. Now to be fair to myself, since there's only a very few amount of components in this race, I'll be able to clone these as much as I like. However, I cannot make anything else. I can't even, even modify these in any sort of way. So, um, yeah, this is going to be fun. So, obviously, we are going to start out with a bowl, because that's really the only thing I can really start off with this race. I, I'm also going to turn off the clouds, which I can do. I'm also going to be using these marbles. I know there's pastel and dark colors, so I'm not going to be using them, mainly because those would just clock up the space. Alright, so let's see how this is going through. Okay, the marbles get stuck immediately, so it looks like we're going to need to pick a spinner. Once I put the spinner in, I can't change it, like, change the speed, direction, whatever. I can move it, rotate it, and scale it, but that's the only things I can really do. Alright, so, okay, so I'm just going to move this to the opposite direction. Okay, this works. <clears throat> and the marbles don't seem to be going up there. But to be safe, I'm just going to add this uh, little area up there. And also, in case you're wondering, I'm not allowed to decompose any of the parts, so I'll have to keep this there as well, which doesn't really look the best, but it's the only thing I can really do. I'm also going to do the same over here, and I... Over here, although I can rotate it, that... So I can do that. So there we go, that's fair game. I can't rotate it, scale it, and move it, but that's all I can do. So this is the race so far, it's not really that complex, in fact it's really short, but as time goes on, this I will add more stuff to it. Just like all good races, I'm going to add multiple balls in different areas. So we're going to add one over here. Alright, so the marbles get stuck. The but the spinner does move them down, so I probably won't move it. Yeah, I won't. Also, knowing it seems to be stuck over there, so I'm, sure, so I'm just going to duplicate this again and put it down here. Okay, so this is where the problem start to go, because um, the marble gets stuck over here, which is not good. So we're going to have to... Uh, um. So I want to be symmetrical, so I'm just going to... I'm just going to move this down a little and do the same heel. There we go, there's a little gaps in there, but the race itself won't, so... Uh, okay, let me see, okay, the marbles do get... Um... Uh, yeah, they do get stuck, so I'll have to use even more spinners, uh, which is always fun. You know what, I'm not going to rotate the items or scale them, I'm... All I can move, do is move them, that's all. I should also move the race a little bit because it's on to intervene with some of the actual components of the race. So there we go, take this spinner, duplicate it, put it down there, and do the same thing down here. Now, if it, now if everything goes according to plan, the marble should go down the course effortlessly. Okay, purple went down, that's good, but I'm worrying that they'll fall down there. So I'm just going to add more of these things um, over there to make sure they don't fall out. As you can see, you aren't really able to be really creative when you're stuck doing these types of uh, challenges. Alright, so I'm just going to put this over here. And I will add a single area, a single spinner and place it over here. Guess. Um. Please save it. Okay, good. It rotates over there. So my plan is to have the marbles just jump to a ball, and if they miss, they just eliminated. Because uh, this is because uh, um I because that still falls into the rules. This doesn't have to be just a normal race. This can be an elimination race as well. 
Fortunately, all the marbles go through, so that's good. So I just have to put the ball in here. I'm going to place it out a little bit. Now I will add an elimination area so the marbles just don't fall. Because I think that's fail. Well, that's the fails I can really do. Yeah, I know it doesn't really look that good, but that's the best I can do for this challenge. Alright, marbles, do your thing. Okay, Orange makes it. Purple doesn't, Cyan does. Purple fails just like purple. Blue fails. Green fails. Magenta fails. Red fails. And yellow, you're my favorite color, so obviously you have to make this. And yellow fails as well. So only three marbles were able to, f like two or three marbles were able to finish. So I will be fair to the marbles, and I will move this a little bit to make it easier. Alright, there we go. Now it's more fair than it was before, so you guys can't complain to me now. So I expect at least half of the marbles to finish. After that is done, I'll, I won't have to configure the race anymore. That's good. Okay, blue, you're forced. You make it. Red, yep. Purple, yep. Cyan, fail. Orange, fail. Green fail, yellow fail, that's sad, and magenta fail, so that was, wait, how many moles do you I think there's 10. Okay, um, no, there's 8, and 5 of them failed, so I still failed on my challenge, so I have to north this even more, but I'm not going to north for that much. Okay, blue makes it, so there's green and purple, sign fails, come on, guys. Yellow barely manages to make it, so half the mix it, so that's fair game, I don't have to change that anymore, that's good. Also, so that the marbles don't fly out, I'm going to um, add this up here. So the only block I've been used so far is uh, this weird spinner thing, so I'm going to incorporate that right now. Okay, so what does that do? Okay, so it's really weird, really weird. So I'm essentially just doing the same thing as last time, except I'm going to make the gap smaller since you know it's way harder to jump through. Okay green and red, you guys can show off these, these other models that failed on the first gap. You can do this. And I, that was what I get for trusting you guys. Oh magenta! Magenta is going to do the ultimate comeback of the century. She's always been called the demon girl and evil and bad luck. But today, she's going to prove all of them wrong. And she doesn't. Just like last time, everyone's failing. Okay, orange makes it. So does purple. Let's go. You can do it. You can do it. And orange and purple fail. But I can still show them off. Come on, do it. Show them that this is possible. Alright, looks like I'm gonna have to know for even more. Okay, at least one person has to make it through that. I'm also going to put this here so that they don't cheat, whatever. And then, like every good Marvel race, I must, I must spam a lot of balls at the end. And I'm going to put one of these at the end and put another one of them at the end over here so that they cannot escape and there we go that's the ending of the race so this is the official Marvel race this is the new Marvel race 4 the fourth edition of the race that everyone's been waiting for over a year now so here we go, here's the official race, I hope you enjoy.
and purple is a winner with green taking second and everyone either fearing the first or second gap. That's just wonderful. So congratulations purple and green, you are the only two that managed to finish this race. So yeah, this is the race I was able to that I made only using these parts. Yeah, real fun. I'm definitely going to do this again.